welcome back to Crochet My House. Been a busy week working on quite a few different things, and Cecile has finished the bunting. So here it is, she's got a few ends to weave in. It, you can see all the stars and trees are on. Those are Jaden Stitches patterns, so I will try and pop them down below. And the chain is just chain stitches, and for this bit, she did slip stitches back up. And it's the Christmas yarn I've used a couple of times before. Uh, I've got a few things I've been working on as well. I now have two of these doilies finished from that Christmas book. And I made a little amigurumi of a character in... 21's Pilots Chlorine video. I don't know if you will know the song. Um, but my friend's son really likes 21 Pilots. So I made him this. Uh, it's Ned and he's got his little fluffy bits at his ears. He's got some safety eyes. Got his little arms, little feet. And his wee horns on top. And I think he was quite a nice amigurumi to make. Fairly simple but fun to do. And um, his head and body are actually one piece. You start at the top and you work your way down. You come in at the neck and then you come back out for the body. I generally like it when they have things like that. Because I don't like it when an amigurumi has an entirely round head that you then have to try and sew on because that could be real annoying because you have to pin it in place and get all perfect whereas this you don't really have to position the head it is already positioned you just position everything else onto it so that's Ned and I am going to be making some more out of this Christmas book I am enjoying the patterns in here. One of the things I plan on showing and doing is this. So I'll show it as I work on it and hopefully have it finished for Christmas. I want to put it on the table. And that is the Winter Wonderland Table Runner. And of course I will link this book down below off of Amazon. It's a good little book. So that's all of the crochet. So moving on to things that have been gotten recently, it's starting it with these lights. So they're decorative garland 20 warm lights and the mini glass baubles. And I have them here. I haven't hung them up yet. This is what it looks like when they're on. So the lights are actually on the string rather than in the baubles. Uh, the plan is these will hang up there along with the bunting as a sort of together thing. And it should look really nice. And I think these baubles are really cute. They're just little glass baubles and they have holographic stars inside them which looks really pretty when the light hits it so that's the first thing just pop that back down there down with its box now i have also gotten some yarn recently so this is chunky yarn and it's from home bargains and it's 100 percent acrylic uh, its colour is red and um, yes I've gotten a few colours so I've gotten red I've gotten mustard light grey and dusty pink so that's the colours I've gotten and the plan is to make some 
Christmas ish pants. So they will be um, able to be worn throughout winter and autumn, but I think the colours and stuff and the pattern I'm thinking of will also give a Christmas vibe. But I've gotten three of the mustard, two of the grey, two of the red and one of the pink. So I shall hopefully get that started soon as well. I'm always starting projects. I do sometimes finish them. Then I have a couple of other things. Starting with some earrings. I actually have a set on that are new. So they're supposed to be little reindeers. Just their heads. I thought they were cute. I also happened to get these stocking ones. Showing up okay. So it's just a red and green stocking. And then we have two craft items. This one's for Cecile. So it's hanging snowflake decoration and she's going to decorate them before they get hung up with um, pens, pencils, things like that and she does need to pop out the parts of the snowflakes and I got this ornament and I just thought it was really cute it's got a wee Christmas tree on top can't remember what the price of this was but it was in hobby craft and it's a minivan and there's a little wreath on the front and a christmas tree on top so that should be a fun thing to do might need to um sand just this little piece here because it's got a rough edge there other than that i think it should be nice and ready for painting and this string can actually be undone for painting so i won't risk getting that mucky One last thing is I also got this advent calendar and it will be going along with my advent videos. So this is a British sweets calendar and you can see the kind of sweets that are in it down here. And I have a plan with my videos. Here you can see there's a little colouring bit and things back here. So this and the two other calendars I've got, I'm going to do some really short videos each day for running up to Christmas. I'm thinking they might be really short lives because it'd be the fastest way for me to get up because then I won't have to edit anything. I won't have to do any double takes. It will just be all in one take and up. So I'm thinking I might do that. If you like that idea, do comment below and tell me if you'd rather the sort of edited videos. I would like to hear about that as well. But in the thing of trying to save time and um, have time for everything else, because obviously running up to Christmas is busy. It's finishing off projects, it's decorating, tidying, wrapping gifts, making cards, you know, all the Christmas stuff. So I won't have time to edit a video every day. So I thought a quick live each day would work. I haven't set a time yet for uploading, but I'm thinking maybe around about half past two, three o'clock. In the afternoon would probably work pretty well. It, we shall see. 
And my question for today will be, have you got any Christmas lights? And have you put any of them up yet? And if so, have you got any of the interesting types of lights like these ones? Because I thought they were really cool. And you get these out of Aldi's. I think Lidl's might have their own as well. But these were quite cute and relatively inexpensive. So remember and like, comment, subscribe and ring the bell for notifications every time I put up a video.